is showing you how you can maintain your kinky coily look if you want to know how to maintain this hair style this coarse texture then please keep on watching this video so take note this client of mine she got this wig from me she's had this wig for over three years i think in the three years of she having this i don't think she ever tried to maintain she just kept on wearing it as she received it and she brought it back to me to help her maintain it so this is what the hair looks like right now so what i'm going to start by doing now is wetting the hair when it comes to hair that is a kinky coil you want to make the hair to be completely drenched wet before you start to comb it or finger comb it so i'm just getting the hair wet now the next step i'm going to be doing is applying some shampoo to the hair to wash the hair after i've gotten the hair completely wet so i'm using the mac is it macadamia macadamia ma macadamia <laughs> you use any very good shampoo you have but that green one right there is the shampoo like, shampoo i'm using just applying the shampoo all over the hair to get the dirt the dust out of the hair just apply the shampoo all over apply the shampoo all over just to make sure it's really lathered in well if it's not enough go back in and get more shampoo continually apply the shampoo until you have the shampoo all over the hair you can even wash the inside of the wig cap that's where the head is being placed in to make sure her area is also very clean then you pour water to rinse off the shampoo because the shampoo now takes when you rinse it off all the dirt comes out of the wig yes so i just kept on pouring water through just to clean out the wig yes you can see this wig is not very dirty she just didn't know how to maintain the wig well because ordinarily i think from the way the wig looked she could still wear how it was but all she needed to do was just put some water on it and just run her fingers through it or maybe just put water on it put a little bit of conditioner or leave-in conditioner or a deep conditioner and just run her fingers through it and voila she's ready to wear but she didn't know how to do it so she brought it back to me to work it so if you're watching this video and you don't know how to make a kinky coily look what i just explained now is how you can maintain your wigs without having to wet get the whole wig completely dry just sprinkle some water on it apply conditioner run your fingers through it or you can even brush through it and you leave it to air dry and you wear it ready to go out so now applying some conditioner to the hair after i finish rinsing off the shampoo and starting from the up part down towards the bottom part you can start from the bottom part and work your way towards the up part any which way goes so long as you apply the product all over the hair so now i'm applying i want to add some deep conditioner this deep conditioner is really going to make the hair get very soft it's going to add a lot of moisture to the hair and this brand of deep conditioner is, is the same brand as the shampoo and conditioner so i'm just applying that deep conditioner all over the hair and i'm using my fingers i'm not going to comb i'm not going to brush through his hair because i like the way the curl pattern is for this wig what i'm going to do for this wig is i'm going to finger detangle it any part of the hair the hair that is that detangled i'm going to use my fingers to just run through it and detangle the hair completely set the curls well so you just watch me do that and please if you're not subscribed to my channel while you're watching this video please kindly click on the subscribe button right below also turn on the post notification bell right beside the subscribe button so you don't miss any of my uploads so and give this video a thumbs up so you can see what i'm doing now i'm just still detangling the hair running my fingers through it just to detangle the hair some folks tend to use a, a comb a white tooth comb or a hairbrush to detangle their hair but i feel like to maintain that like the, the curl pattern of a kinky coily hair it's best to use your fingers to detangle it because if you start to use a hairbrush or comb the curl pattern might start to so it might it might get it might not be set the way it was originally again so use your fingers to detangle it you can see what i'm doing i'm just using my fingers and walking through the hair gradually walking through it while, while the conditioner and the deep conditioner is still in there walking my fingers through it and i'm even going back to reach for more product supply on the hair just to make sure the hair is really well taken care of look how i'm digging it in small sections and applying it back onto the wig yeah so let's keep on applying it if you're going to invest in getting coily hair extensions you should know that coily hair extensions are well is really high maintenance so if, you, if you're not willing to take the time to decondition your hair to condition it you know do all the necessary styling necessary for a coily hair then i don't think you should be investing in coily hair extensions because this is the amount of um, maintenance that's required for your coily hair if you feel like you want something that is more effortless please reach out
out for your straight hair and your wavy hair because coily hair if you're gonna get coily hair because you should be ready to invest your time in making sure the curls are always set the hair is always soft and take note coily hair is always prone to tangling and shedding it says it's just normal fat so what you then need to do is get the hair wet and condition the hair because of the and that's because of the way the curl pattern of the hair is it that just makes it prone to tangling and shedding so make sure you are ready to always condition the hair because if you leave the hair tangled up without without um applying your conditioner finger coming through the hair coming through the hair frequently it's going to get matted it's going to get tangled more frequently and by the time you you start to you know try to detangle it it might have it may have tangled up a whole lot and that might lead to a lot of shedding in the hair but this particular look here did not shed it it didn't shed a lot at all just very little hair that i lost in the process so i'm just combing the upper part of the wig you know that area uh, um, at the upper part the closure area because it's not really easy for you to really um, detangle that up area with your hands so i'm using a comb to just walk through that area sort of smooth it out and i'll use my hand and just take the clumpy parts downward i wouldn't comb through all of the wig i'll just use either my hands or i'll use the i'll use the, the, um, the tip of the comb to just do a um, walk through but using my hand to just walk through so that's basically how um to just use your fingers to comb through your kinky curly hair and take note after i've um, applied this conditioner all over this hair i'm going to leave the conditioner on this hair overnight some people choose to um boil hot water and just soak the hair in the hot water and then you rinse it off and air dry it but for this particular video i choose to just leave the conditioner on the hair overnight and then i rinsed it off um the following morning and air dry it take note when you will wash your hair it's always best for you to air dry your hair air drying your hair is better than using a blow dryer to dry it especially when it's coily hair it's always best to air dry your coily hair you can see how the curls look right now very healthy curls beautiful bouncy well set everything looks nice with this wig now everything looks really nice you can see the upper part of that wig really well detangled very fresh <laughs> yes really nice really really nice So while I'm still walking through this hair, um, if you have questions or you want to see any type of video on this channel, let me know in the comment section if you have um, questions on or or anything, any issue you have with your hair extension, I just want you to like um, throw lights on me, let me know in the comment section. So I already washed through the hair and air dried it at this point. So this is what the wig looks like now after I rinsed it off and air dried it for a day. So this is what the hair looks like before the wig. It looks really nice. Yes, it looks really, really nice. It looks fresh. It looks new. Yeah, I just want to put my mama in here so you guys can get a very good view of the wig. Yes. Yeah, it looks really nice if I say so myself. What do you think? Do you think it looks better before washing it or how it looks now? Yeah, the curls are well set. It's, it's just, it looks really nice. Whew so if you enjoyed watching this video please make sure you give the video a huge thumbs up share with your friends are also going to get value out of it and please subscribe to my channel if you're not yet subscribed if you have a kinky coily wig and you experienced any issues when you're trying to wash it or you just always find it difficult to maintain your kinky, kinky coily wigs let me know the, whatever issues you have with it in the comment section and i'll be glad to respond to you as quickly as i possibly can yeah so this is the wig right here very beautiful it was made with i think it is 18 inch yeah 18 inch hair three bundles and four by four closure really nice really really nice with hair and the hair is from inner beauty hair thanks so much for watching remember be good have courage in a positive life bye